Hello friends, welcome to Learn One. In previous lecture, we have learned about the theory portion of bitwise operators in Ruby. And today, we will learn about the practicals of AND operator in Ruby. Bitwise operator operates on bits. So, for performing these examples, we need to add one extra keyword that is 0b to perform the binary operations. For example, I am writing one value of binary that is triple zero double one double one. Right now, I want to perform execution, but how the system came to know that I want to perform the binary operation on this value. So for that, we need to add extra prefix that is zero b to our variables value. So the system that is the IRB console, the Ruby understood that this is an binary number and I need to perform the binary values. So let's start with our first example of bitwise operator that is bitwise end. So let me create our first variable that is variable a and I am adding a prefix that is 0b. Here you can see in a screen I have added 0b and my the and my binary value that is let me say triple zero triple one double one this is actually the value of 31 that is a numeric value now i am creating another variable variable b and i am again adding a prefix zero b and my second value for that variable that is double zero double one double one double zero this is actually the binary value of 60 okay so we have two variables now and now what i need to do is i need to perform binary and operation so let's write my variable variable a and the binary operator that is emerson and my variable b and this will gives us the output that is 28 you can see here in a screen so now what actually it internally has done is let me show you a practical uh, demonstration for example let me create a text editor Now we will understood how this output came. So here we have created one variable that is variable a and it contains a value triple zero triple one double one and one another variable that is variable b and it contains a value double zero double one double one double zero and we have performed an end operation variable a and variable b so how this and operation works for that let's see here how and will work it will take an output that is similar to both so here you can see our first digit is one but its respective digit is zero so the output is here first digit will be 0 now we will check the second digit that is 1 and variable b contains 0 so again we have 0 for the third digit it is having 1 and 1 so it matches for both so we have 1 for fourth digit we again having 1 and 1 that is common to both so we will have 1 for fifth one we are again having same value 1 and 1 so again value 1 for sixth digit variable a contains 0 and variable b contains 1 so here we have 0 and for the first two digit both are 0 so here 0 0 so this is our actually bits output that is an binary output 
now we want to check whether our output is correct or not so let's create one variable here uh, suppose let me give a name as a output and we will put our value that is we have seen in the text box triple zero triple one double zero and it will give us the output 28 so this is the illustration that how this and operation works in backend so you have seen that this is the by our value a that is of digit 31 variable b that contains actually 60 but here this is actually the binary value and we have performed and operation and we are having output 28 so this is how we can easily work with bitwise and operator in next lecture we will learn about the practicals of or operator in ruby